Hey, it's a dandelion wine update. I know it's been a couple months. Um, I have revamped the basement. I think I showed you that when I got the strawberry going. But uh, here's what's happening with the dandelion. Uh, I've got uh, four, seven, about 12 bottles uh, bottled up already. Got the siphon going. There is the jug, about half empty. Wanted to show you this glass that I poured off. Look at that. Nice and just really clear. Looks nice. Tastes a little fresh, but should be good. So, uh, got the rest of these bottles. Another bunch down here. So, we're going to go ahead and get this transferred off and the uh, iced grape is still working and the iced apple is still working the strawberry has cleared somewhat you can see the sediment in the bottom of those um, there's some dandelion that my friend Carrie gave me that, uh, some from 1999 2007 and a touch of 2008 so we'll go ahead and get this bottled up I'm gonna do some corking here in a minute and uh, still got to do that American Lager. So, tune back in. There we are. 20 bottles. Ended up with 20 bottles of Dino Vino's Dandelion. So, the only problem is all the recipes say you're supposed to let it sit for a year so probably ain't gonna happen but uh, we'll go as long as we can and uh, probably gonna have to send some down to Cincinnati some to Florida and wherever we'll get requests from all over the world for it so uh, we'll talk to you when we get racking on the rest of this stuff